Level 2 mining. Alright, we haven't looked at the mining trees yet. So for mining, we get, looks like a crafting tree. Uh, gain 150 bonus gold per day. Crafting any item also gives you 8 gold. Breaking a rock with a pickaxe restores mana. Uh, let's try this. Stone nodes drop 2 extra stone. Copper nodes drop extra ore. Okay, this top row is uh, where to go, I think. I know it wouldn't make sense, but I do kind of wish, given the size of the town and stuff, that I could just, like, transport to my, my farm. Not necessarily any, anywhere else, but to the farm. I did not mean to do that. Water all these. Yeah, look at all that. Okay, we need logs now. Cooking pot turns crops and ingredients into food. Grinder grinds wheat and green root into pet food. Furniture table crafts decorations for your house and farm. Wooden fence, wooden torch, earth fertilizer, wood floor tile. I don't want to mess with tiling and stuff yet, but a furniture table could be interesting. It takes one hour. What are you doing, Snakoon? So he needs ten apples and five... That might be bundles of wheat? I'm assuming that those crops aren't ready. No idea. I don't know what the hell I'm supposed to do with that. How to how to get that spider web? Oh, maybe I maybe I have to chop the tree down to get it. Leveled up again. Exploration. Magic wizard tomes get 50% as much max mana. That would be a nice one to have, especially early on. Trees drop extra logs, increase damage to trees. Money bags have a 12% chance to give 1,000 gold. All treasure chests give 200 more gold. I'm gonna go for that max mana one. Just because early on that's good is because I'm assuming that's not retroactive. There's another sand dollar, that's a third one. Look at all this free shit. What's this? Repair broken bridge for 20 wood planks. Not right now, I don't think I have that many. Oh, I don't have any on me. But it would probably be a good idea to repair that at some point. So let's go see how many wood planks we can make with our many how many logs we have. Talk to Warnart and Lucia. Are these the logs I needed? After this, the hospital will never run out of tongue depressors again. In fact, I may have gone a bit overboard asking for so many logs. Oh well, thanks for coming through. No problem. Oh, he loves me. It's going to take a long time in this game before I know where people are. Hi, Lynn. Oh, hello. Aren't you my train buddy? It's good to see a face that I actually recognize. What do you do here, Lynn? 
I'm a blacksmith, or I guess apprentice blacksmith. Solon is teaching me, but I've only just started training with him. I hope to be as good as him one day. Blacksmithing? That wouldn't have been my first guess. Everyone seems surprised when they hear that, but I don't see why. Many women in my old village work the forge. Is it really so odd? Where did you say you're from? I'm from a little village in the east, so I'm still learning to live in a big city like this. It's a lot to take in. If you think this is a big city, you really are clueless. Oh, I'm really sorry, I didn't know. See ya. Who the hell are you? You're the new neighbor? Welcome to town. I'm Alpaca, nice to meet you. My name's Kamala. Oh, and nice meeting you too. You look tired, Alpaca. You need a cat nap, meow. Thanks for trying, Mia. It's the least I could do. Raimi. Hey, neighbor. I'll introduce myself. I'm Raimi. People might tell you I'm the toughest guy in town, but that's just what people say. Good meeting you, Raimi. I'm Alpaca. Oh, Alpaca. That's right. You're the farmer we've been expecting. We really needed someone to clean up that old farm. Great to have you. Alright, let's go home instead of passing out today. Come on, fishy. You fooled me. Oh, I scared it. I caught a sea bass. Put this crafting table here. Okay. So we need fabric and wood planks for crafting most of this stuff. These are just decorations. Okay. All right, so we just uh, we're watering our plants, crops, I guess they're called to the the farming people out there. Um, so it looks like we've got I don't know what any of this stuff means. So retaining soil, increased chance crops stay watered overnight by fifteen percent. Cooking recipes craft twenty five percent faster, or crops sell for ten percent more. Uh, I definitely want the rain cloud spell. Hmm. Well, let's sell for 10% more since we're starting out. Yeah, look at all those planks. Hmm. Yeah, poop out those planks. Okay. So. We get another chest. Go ahead and craft a cooking pot. Let's try to get some more stone while we're at it. I need to find a mine. Okay, we've repaired the bridge. Looks like Nathaniel's just chilling over here. Let's open this chest first. Hi, Alpaca. Got any crops growing yet? Let's talk. So, you're in charge of all the soldiers in Sunhaven? Yes, indeed. I'm captain of the guard. The Sunhaven Corps includes some of the finest soldiers I've seen. In truth, I'm honored to lead them. What makes them stand out from other soldiers? You won't find soldiers with more spirit than those under my command. Even if there isn't a lot of fighting to do here, they manage to keep their chins up. With the military here, I can't help but wonder, is Sunhaven in any danger? At the moment? No, not at all. The army established this outpost as a preventative measure, see? We're only here to make sure nothing bad walks into town. It's comforting to have you here. I'm happy we're here, too. Sunhaven is a gem of a city. I'm glad to protect it. See ya. What's this way? 
Oh, nice. Shortcut to Pete's. What's up, Peter? Hi there, farmer. Spending some time with the sea today. I have to ask about the crab. The what? Oh, you mean Shelby. You named it? I named her. And she's the finest lady I ever sailed with. I was shipwrecked once and washed ashore. Shelby pinched me right on the cheeks and woke me up before the tide swept me out again. She's my savior and my first mate. What's your opinion on Withergate? That's a city that's supposed to be dark all the time, right? I hear a lot of tall tales from port to port, but Withergate might be the tallest tale yet. So you don't think it's true? I didn't say that. In my experience, it's best to be wary of these things. True or not. See you, Peter. Okay, so we need to talk to Lucia and Topi. If I can find them. Oh, more quests. My house is way too dark in the evening. Can anyone make me a nice lamp? I'm thinking a wooden torch will go nice nicely in my home. Okay. Donate 500 gold to Amanda again. How much money does she think I have? Shouldn't Peter be giving you your money? Lucia! Are these the sand dollars I've requested? Well, thank you, Alpaca. I must repay you for the for your time. Go on and have this. No problem. Yeah. Level 5 Exploration. Listen to my words, Alpaca. I can sense your power growing. Your service to Sunhaven has been notable, but today the safety of Sunhaven depends on you. I'm on my way. Farewell, Alpaca. Holy moly, you're donating the entire 500 gold? That's incredible. Leave it to the farmer to get the job done. Welcome. I'm a man to the librarian. Please treat my books with respect. My name's Alpaca. Happy to meet you. Hmm, sure you are. Anyway, please be quiet while you're here. She's kind of a bitch. Oh, what a cozy reading nook. I should probably level up that, uh... Picking up a forageable. Regenerates 6 HP and 6 mana. Who's that? Say... I don't recognize your face. My name's Alpaca. I'm the new farmer here. Oh, the farmer. That's right. Lucia told us there was someone moving in there. It's good to meet you. My name is Judith. Hey there, farmer. Are you headed to Dragon's Meat? I need an escort to Dragon's Meat. Well, here we are. Are you going to talk to the Sun Dragon? Or did you come to or did you make me come all the way up here for no reason? I came here for romance, Rosa. Wait, can I? Gimme. Nope, okay. It gladdens me to see you coming into your strength, Alpaca. Now I ask you to use your power for the good of Sunhaven. An unfamiliar energy has emerged in recent days. A dark energy. I believe it to be spreading in our world. But I know not where. Alpaca, I need to confer with my kin, the other guardian dragons in this region. It is imperative that I seek their knowledge about this darkness. At the very least, I will warn them to stay vigilant. Still, I must not leave Sunhaven unguarded. I will lay a safeguard spell over the town to offer some protection while I am gone. For this, Alpaca, I ask your help. Delve into the forest east of Sunhaven and find a crystal called Glorite. Glorite grows abundantly there, but I need only one. It is crucial that you not take more than one crystal, Alpaca. The livelihood of the forest animals depends on those crystals. Alpaca, return with the crystal promptly so I may begin my journey. Okay. Wield the slicey weapon on your way to victory. Uh... I'll take the sword. Oh, 
Are you ready to head back? I'm ready to go. I wish there was like a direction on how to get to quests, because like, I don't know where Toby is. I don't even know if I've met Toby. Good day, adventurer. Find yourself wanting for protection? One look at my cart can solve that. Can I ask about your eye? Go on, kid, just ask your question. How did you lose it? When I was younger than you are now, I went looking in a crystal ball to see my future. Well, the ball turned out to be cursed. Held me captive and glowed so bright that it burned blindness into my eye. So, there you go. I can tell you more about it another time. I've got lots to tell, you know. If you have a spot of free time, why don't you come by for a tape? What are you selling? Okay. So apparently we cannot sell items to people. We just have to put them in our uh, thing out front. Hi there, alpaca. You always seem to have perfect timing. Thanks to Pinto's clumsiness, I've got a job for you. What did Pinto do? Pinto was sent to gather coal to heat the barracks at night. But he dropped the whole basket into the river on the way back. I guess there was a bee involved. He seemed embarrassed, so I didn't ask questions. What do you need? We'll need eight pieces of coal to keep us all warm and toasty tonight. Think you can swing it? I'll get right on it. Fantastic. You're a real credit to Sunhaven, Alpaca. You can bring the coal to me. Anna! Hey there, Alpaca. Buying anything today or just looking to chat? You're always out for a sale, huh? How did you get started as a merchant? Let's just say I've been supporting myself for a long time. I learned the ins and outs of trade to survive from a young age. I'm living proof that survival is for the fittest. That sounds hard on your own. Don't be afraid to lean on others for help. Or, that's actually inspiring. You're a real life success story. Don't be afraid to lean on others. I didn't ask for your opinion, so keep your thoughts to yourself. Do you plan to stay in Sunhaven long? If business doesn't pick up someday soon, I might have to move on. Sunhaven has been good to me, though. I'm really pulling for this town. I hope you're able to stick around. Me too, Alpaca. Packing everything up and moving is such a hassle for me, not to mention expensive. No matter how well I secure the card, something always comes loose and makes a huge mess. <clears throat> Goose Bay needs a loom. Elizabeth. She wants a pufferfish. So I guess we're not giving that to the cat. Camilla! Wow, great work. You could consider a career in woodcraft, you know? Anyway, here's some gold for your work. No problem. Take that extra XP. Hi there. Here to practice your small talk? You help people find their partners? I can't find the partner for you, but I can make sure you're prepared when you do find them. I'll take any help I can get. Exactly. I can't do it for you, but I can help. That's my whole business model. So, what made you choose to sell this stuff? I was always the matchmaker in my hometown, so I thought I'd take my talents on the road. Who knows how many families I've started along the way. You're doing important work. It feels good knowing that I make a difference wherever I go. Is there like an orphanage? Like, where do I find these children? Oh, barracks. Hello, Allison. My name's Allison, but my friends call me Ali. What's yours? I'm Alpaca. Nice to meet you. Very glad to meet you, Alpaca. It's nice to see fresh faces in this town. Soldiers Diet Weekly. This week's hot recommendations are Earth's Pie and Mashed Potatoes with Gravy. There seems to be a feature article by someone named The Savvy Swordsman. They've ranked swords from best to worst. Copper, Iron, Adamant, Mithril, oh, Mithril, Sunit. The magazine is open to a page full of armor sets. There are circles drawn around copper armor, iron, adamant, mithril, and sunite. Okay. Nathaniel's bedroom. A helmet that looks like it's seen some battles. Judging by the damage, the wearer was lucky to have it. You're the new neighbor Lucia told me about. I'm Tanya. Glad to meet you. Good to meet you, too. You're living on the farm, right? I'm the town's courier, so I'll be delivering your mail there. 
Okay, Tanya. Well, Alicia stays here. Hello, Alpaca. Since you moved in, I've had a good feeling. It's as though Sunhaven is embers, but the wind is kicking up flames. What are your plans for Sunhaven? We're in an uphill battle to revive Sunhaven's economy. It's crucial that we bring more travelers and new shops into town. Every life in Sunhaven depends on my ability to make that happen. Still, I'm not worried. Sunhaven has a bright future, and I'll be there fanning the flames. Will you help me? I'll do whatever I can to help our town. I'm thankful, Alpaca. There's something about you. I can't help but think Sunhaven is better for having you in it. Well, what's it like being in charge? It certainly comes with its challenges. At first, very few people accepted me as leader because I'm so young. I had to earn everyone's support gradually. Now everyone in town looks to me when there's a decision to make. To be fair, you are quite young. I'm well aware, Alpaca. If you have any doubt about me, just give it time. You'll come around. See ya. <gasps> Penguin! Oh, a penguin and a shark. Okay. Where are these fucking children? Mine floor one. There are many kinds of rocks, ores, and gems in the mines that become more valuable as you dig deeper. A rusty key hidden on this floor will unlock the next floor temporarily. You may craft key at an anvil to unlock the next floor permanently. This floor requires a copper key. Okay. Mining is leveled up. Copper nodes drop extra. Crafting any items gives you gold. Gain 150 bonus gold per day. Let's do with the copper nodes right now. Oh, we got a sapphire. Level 4 mining. Yes, honey. Climb up. Yeah, climb up on my lap. Ooh, almost got stuck. <clears throat> I lost 400 gold for passing out in my house because I was looking at my inventory. Damn it. Settling in all right, are we? What's on your mind, farmer? Have you lived here your whole life, doctor? No, I relocated from the southern islands just about a year ago. The south is great, but I'm lucky to be here. Sunhaven has been good for me. Do you miss the southern region? I'll tell you what I do miss. The fruit. Fruit trees grow all over the place down there. I used to pick a free breakfast while walking to work every day. One less thing to worry about, you know? You the only doctor here? Don't worry, I'm well equipped to take care of this town. Besides, 
Almost everyone here is in great health. It's honestly a little boring for me. But I'd much rather be bored than stressed out. More people could use a little boredom in their life. I agree completely. I always feel better after slowing down and taking a breath. Sunhaven has let me do that more than ever before. Oh, what's this? A bakery. <clears throat> this looks so good, I should buy a slice for the road. It's like a cat furnace. Liam's house. I don't remember which one Liam is. I've never met Liam. Hello, you must be the one who bought the old farm. I'm Liam. It's good to meet you. Pleasure to meet you, Liam. I'm Alpaca. Likewise, about the pleasure, not the name. My name's Liam. But I already told you that. Sorry. I don't mind working long hours. It's going long hours without eating that really hits me. <laughs> pizza! There's pizza! Ooh. Farmer, it's you? I mistook you for a bandit just now. I don't know how things are done where you come from, but in Sunhaven, we don't take from our neighbor's fields. I'm so sorry, it won't happen again. Thanks, I really want us to be good neighbors. Hello again, yeah? What's up? What do you do here, kitty? I run the pet store. Are you surprised? Yeah. You run the store all by yourself? Not only that, I take care of all the animals in Sunhaven Town. I even sell animals you could use on your farm. Did you say yeah? Yeah, that's right. Haven't you met a cat like me before? Don't tell me I'm your first yeah. Oh my goodness. Then what do you think of my ears? They look fluffy and cute. Yeah, you really mean it? Just don't stare too long, Oki. Okay? You know what? Fuck that child who I can't find. You're getting the puffer fish, kitty. Alpaca, thank you, thank you. I absolutely love it, nya. You bet. Oh, kitty is going to be our wife. Who are you? Oh, it's Jean. Alpaca, great to see you again. If you have the time, I'd love to check in with you. I am the town's counselor, after all. What do you do as counselor? Simply put, I talk to people about their problems. If you're feeling overwhelmed, come find me. Everyone needs somebody to talk to. This town is lucky to have someone like you in it. Thanks, Alpaca. I knew you were a kind person. Sure, let's check in. How are you settling in? Sometimes I get lost around here. I would love to help, but I'm terrible at giving directions. Damn it, June, you awful counselor. Can't help people find their way in a town you live in. Hopefully there's like a really good map once this game's uh, out of early access. But I'm not, uh, not trying to find all of these people every day that I need. Like, I've got stuff to turn into Nathaniel and Topi. I've never seen Topi before. the hell? Claude is rich as hell. No wonder he's always at the tavern. Jesus. Maybe I'll marry Claude. There's Claude. Ooh, who are you? Calvin. You look like a girl, Calvin. Hi, citizen. Oh, you're the new arrival, huh? Neat. I'm Calvin. Welcome to paradise. The soldiers will be grateful to have this. Thanks again, Alpaca. No problem. Let's do that combat XP. Combat! Gain 15 max mana. And we can do chain it. We can do chain lightning next. <laughs> That's not cute as eating so much stuff. What do you need? You need 10 apples? And ten bananas. I haven't seen bananas yet. What's this? Oranges. Hmm. 
No, I died. Oh wow, he hit me hard. So apparently we need to level up before we go to the forest. I felt like the house is a little too quiet lately. I could use a groovy record to liven up the place. Tanya recommended groovy jazz, and I've been curious ever since. I can trade some fresh food in return. Where the hell am I going to get that? Needed ASAP, two copper swords for new recruits to use, pays 1200 gold. Well, I'm not making stuff yet, but eventually that'll be a good quest to have. Alright, so I'm not sure if I'm going to do more videos on this or not, but uh, so far... Um, yeah, I'm a huge fan of Stardew Valley. Uh, this is the closest I've gotten to a game being uh, as fun as Stardew Valley uh, in this uh, genre of farming life sims. So I'm looking forward to playing a hell of a lot more of this and uh, highly recommend checking it out once it's out of early access or right now in early access if you want. You do you.